Hi everyone, welcome to Ignite Faith Day 3. I apologize that I'm on this afternoon instead of the morning, but I am here nonetheless, so let's get started. I'm going to share a scripture verse with you first. Let me just get this set up. All right. Hi, Tim. Thank you for joining. I'm going to share the scripture verse uh, first. Before we start, let me pray. Father, I thank you for today. I thank you, Holy Spirit. I pray that you would move upon each and every person watching. Have your way in the name of Jesus. Use me as a vessel unto your use, Father. Touch each and every person watching today, Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hi. Hi, Kofi. Okay, so Psalm 5, verse 7. But as for me, I will come into your house in the multitude of your mercy. In fear of you, I will worship toward your holy temple. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness. Because of my enemies, make your way straight before my faith. Before my face, sorry. Lead me, O Lord. In your righteousness, because of my enemies, make your way straight before my faith. Face. I don't know why I keep saying faith. So, what does the scripture verse say? Come into your house. I come into your house. You know, the Lord's mercy, uh, the Lord's mercies are new upon us every day. And every day, you know, we are in a spiritual battle, the Bible says. And uh, some days... You know, there's different seasons in our journey. There's different, I was just speaking with um, Timothy, Tim. You know, I, I look sometimes at this journey, this Christian journey as like a video a, a video game. Not that it's a game, but um, I'm paralleling a video game. And that, you know, it's like level, you're at level one, you know, like Christianity 101. <laughs> And you got to defeat the boss at the end of the level to move up to the next level, up to the next level, up to the next level. And then the ultimate defeat, you know, you know, when you win the ultimate game like Mario um, is, you know, ultimately when the Lord Jesus comes back and destroys um, all evil and wickedness, as the book of Revelation says. So there are different um, steps in this walk and this journey with the Lord Jesus Christ where... You know, it's like uh, you have to be a spiritual ninja, you know, get your, I don't know what it's called, that baton, kata thing, where you just got to like, you turn around, there's an enemy here, enemy here, enemy here, coming at you, coming at you, coming at you. You know, lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies. Make your way straight before my face in the name of Jesus. So I just want to uh, worship right now. Uh, scripture tells us that uh, the Spirit of the Lord, the Lord dwells in the praises of His people. So we're going to get some praise and worship kicking right now um, to build us up and encourage us to continue fighting the good fight of faith. Amen? Amen. Let me find a song. We got, oh, hi, Tiffany. How come I can't see everybody that's online? I'm not sure why that happens. So whoever's on, just comment, say hello. So I know, I know who's on. <laughs> Sorry, I had a song. Um, but it was the wrong one. Not the one I was after. Is it raining here? Oh, hi, Allison. See, I can't see everybody. Thank you for saying hi. Is it raining here? No, it is not. It is not raining here. 
Are you guys getting a lot of rain there in Michigan? water running. Uh -huh. That is my husband's, um, we have a turtle tank and the water is really low so I'll be sure to tell him he needs to um, add some water to that tank so I'm sorry about that. Oh, <laughs> amen. Oh, I have not, Tiffany. I'll, I'll go back and I'll, and I'll look at your post. I don't think I did anyhow. Today's been busy so all right, let's just, it's peaceful. Yeah, it is peaceful. It's like nature in your own home. So right now, I'm going to play the song um, Yeshua by Jesus Image. Let's just, let's just love the Lord. Let's just love him. distractions that you might hear in my house. We also have dogs. I'm praying in the name of Jesus that they don't bark to go outside in the middle of this.
I see you standing tall. I see you standing with confidence. I see you standing like strong in the Lord. And um, I was hearing the word promise keeper. He is a promise keeper. There's some promises that you're standing on. The Lord is a promise keeper. He is true to his word. His word will not return void to him. So I just want to encourage you. I want to encourage you to keep standing um, firm on the rock. I want to encourage you to keep standing firm on his word. And so I'm praying you're still here. Maybe Tiffany, you could um, send her a quick little message because I'm gonna um, I'm gonna sing for specifically for that for Kaylee. sure how well you can hear my voice over the piano but Kaylee I see you I see you standing firm and standing confident and strong on the rock and I see the Lord like I see I see the Lord handing you weapons of warfare like I see him handing you swords and I see you taking those swords and I see you you know fending off the lies of the enemy the doubts and the things that are creeping in and I, I see you um being strengthened like he like almost like he's preparing your hands for battle um He's preparing your hands for battle. So I'm going to keep interceding for you and praying this over you. He's preparing your hands for battle. He's training your hands. He's training your hands. He's training your hands in the name of Jesus. He's training your hands in the name of Jesus. He's training your hands for battle in Jesus' name. 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 Jesus name. Be strengthened in the Lord in the name of Jesus. Be strengthened.
healing rain fall upon her now in the name of Jesus. In the name of the broadcast was paused. Bind every wound now in the name of Jesus. Bind every wound. Father, you are our healer. Jesus. 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 I declare and I decree in the name of Jesus that Kelly walks forth in your wholeness, in the wholeness of Jesus Christ. In a sound mind in the name of Jesus. For you have given her because we're going against the grains of this world when, when we choose um, that kind of lifestyle for our family. And um, I just want you to know, you know, that you are not forgotten. You are not forgotten in the name of Jesus. You are not forgotten in the name of Jesus. You are not forgotten in the mighty name of Jesus. The Lord sees you. His hand is upon you. His hand is upon you. The enemy wants to make you feel like you're alone in this battle. But you're not alone for the Lord God Almighty goes before you in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' name. I declare that over you now in the name of Jesus. Father, go before her. Go before her now in the name of Jesus. Go before her now in the name of Jesus. Father, go before her now in the mighty name of Jesus. Let your healing hand come upon her, Father. Let your healing hand come upon her. Strengthen her mortal body now in Jesus' name. Strengthen her mortal body now in the name of Jesus. Strengthen her to continue fighting the good fight, my Father. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Father, give her dreams and visions. Give her dreams and visions of your will for her life, Father, in Jesus' name. Let her know. Let her know, Father, your will for her life. Let her confidence be in you. Let her strength be in you. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' name.
and then something else comes and something else comes and it kind of like it kind of like um, has depleted you in a sense like you felt like in the past you know you felt like you could never measure up to that standard of providing for your household but I see that Jesus has seen the entire thing he's seen the entire thing but it's almost like now you're at a place where um, there's just complete and full surrender and the Lord is saying I'm gonna move I'm going to move on your behalf because you've surrendered everything to him. Everything is at his feet. And this is the moment he's been waiting for. And he is going to knock your socks off. He is seriously going to blow your family away. In Jesus name, provision, provision. We thank you, Father, for provision. We thank you for your mighty hands upon this household. We thank you for your mighty hand upon Matt's household and upon his family. In Jesus name, I thank you, my Father, for provision.
this word is for, but I see, um, I see in the spirit, a man standing like in the forest. Hi, Teresa. I see a man standing like, it's almost like a rainforest, like in a forest. And there's this leopard that just like came out, came towards this individual but they were so sharp spiritually. I feel like that's you, uh, Jacob. Like, like the Lord has given you this spiritual sharpness to discern um, the attacks of the enemy, to discern um, the wiles of the devil, um, to to come against him. It's like you're just you're sharp. You're aware um, of of your surroundings spiritually. I pray in the name of Jesus. I thank you, my Father, for that spiritual discernment. Sharpen it more now. In the name of Jesus, sharpen it even more. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Hi, Rachel. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. just approaching people and sharing the gospel with them and sharing your testimony with them and I'm seeing I'm seeing um, a harvest the Lord has a harvest for you the Lord has a harvest for you the enemy has come so strongly against your life and tried to snuff it out but the Lord God Almighty's will will prevail in your life in the name of Jesus the Lord's will will prevail in your life in the mighty name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus, I declare and I decree, the Lord's will will prevail in your life in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. 
In Jesus' name. you've been using your words as weapons you know like in, in a natural sense like retaliating anger bitterness frustration and you're just letting it all out and the lord is saying drop your natural weapons and take up your spiritual weapons drop your natural weapons and take up your spiritual weapons because the natural weapons and the battle in the natural is just wearing you down it's wearing you down emotionally 
it's wearing you down physically because we know that our emotions are connected to our physical body. So it's actually making you feel fatigued and tired and drained. And the Lord is saying, drop your natural weapons. Put them down. Lay them down and take up his weapons. Take up the spiritual weapons that he has given us to fight in the name of Jesus. Because our fight, our battle is spiritual. It is not natural. So you're just... You're wasting your time in the natural. You're wasting your energy. It's like the enemy is just exhausting you. He's exhausting your flesh to the point where you just surrender. But I declare and I decree and I prophesy to you now in Jesus' name. I prophesy to you now in Jesus' name that you will rise. You will rise. You will rise. You will not fall, but you will rise in the name of Jesus. You will not fall, but you will rise in the name of Jesus. You will not fall, but you will rise in Jesus' name. 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 You will rise in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I thank you, Father. I thank you, Father. I thank you, Father. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. everybody for joining i am going to end there um i have to pick up my kids from school soon but uh, i apologize for coming on later than i had announced but i thank you um i thank you for joining i thank you for participating i thank you in jesus name father i thank you for each and every one i thank you for kaylee i thank you for tiffany i thank you for jacob and matt allison and timothy i thank you I thank you for Janie Jane. I thank you for each and every one. Father, I thank you for Teresa. I thank you for Rachel. I pray in Jesus' name. I pray in Jesus' name that the peace of God would go before you this week. Amen. You're welcome. Amen, Kaylee. You'll have to message me. You'll have to testify so I understand what was happening. Amen. Thanks, Matt. Thanks, Tiff. All right, guys, I'll see you. You're welcome, Allison. I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow, hopefully in the morning before lunch sometime. But I pray that you guys have a blessed day and you were touched by the power of God and the Holy Spirit. And enjoy the rest of your day. I look forward to hearing your testimony. Um, Kaylee, bye for now. <laughs>